suggested last night that uh, uh, the whole thing was run by white power and that Maley should resign. Uh, is this an overall feeling throughout the program, or was this just one individual speaking out? Well, I think uh, uh, any, any, any sentiment of this nature reflects uh, long frustrations. Uh, they reflect uh, a desire in a certain segment of unity for people to be more self-determined. It reflects sometimes people's feelings that uh, the lack of communication uh, evident. And out of this, uh, these types of, uh, of, of pronouncements come forth. I think they're very natural phenomena. Tell Me Your Problems was one of the opening lines by subcommittee chairman, State Senator Roy Harrington. He was talking to a group of university professors from five area state institutions who met together this morning in an informal hearing at the University of Texas at Arlington. The subcommittee's realm of work is faculty fringe benefits, and in this area, the professors have problems. Two benefit categories that have been achieved for many people from private companies long ago, such as retirement plans and insurance, still lag for the professors. To Dr. Howard Lackman of the UTA History Department, the problem is a very close one. He has recently been active in attempts at recruitment. We want first-class personnel. We'd like to have the greatest scholars in the country. To attract them, we have to offer them a competing salary with the area they're in, and we have to give them the fringe benefits and the retirement benefits that can compete with elsewhere in the country. Thus far, uh, when we have found an, an attractive applicant, we have not been successful in luring them from other areas of the country here because we are not competing. But before the whole meeting wound up this morning, the professors evolved to the point of saying that the problem was more than just needed extra benefits. Dr. Harold Hollingsworth of the UTA History Department explains. It's not just extra benefits. To the matter, we need a whole change in our approach to education in Texas, at least our approach to higher education. What we have to do is stop thinking of the college as just an extension of high school. College is a place for research, and research benefits the community. I've played, uh, I've played every position in my career, but basically a first baseman outfielder. Well, would you, uh, do you think your future is at first base, or do you, do you like it behind the plate? Well, I really like it, catching. Uh, I think my future in this game is going to depend on how I do with the catching more than as a first baseman. Well, of course, I think there's a, there's a shortage of catchers more so than any other position in baseball, too. That's right, and with expansion coming up, I'm real hopeful that I can uh, make it in the next couple of years. Well, of course, the early days of the exploration of space issues like asking the Wright brothers, you know, in 1904, what's the next thing in, in aviation? And of course, they couldn't even have imagined what was going to come. We can just glimpse some of the possibilities of space travel. I'm sure that uh, in the next century, there'll be men on all the planets or in orbit around the planets and on the satellites of the various planets of this solar system. And probably we'll be preparing space probes to go out across real space to the stars. We're looking thoroughly into the question now of what weather or meteorological conditions were present and what information was known and perhaps disseminated to the flight crew before and during the ill-fated flight. Uh, we're also conducting many other areas, but however, we have been precluded by the NTSB from becoming a party, and we, we feel that the traveling public des does deserve an impartial representative on the investigative team. Right now, all of the detectives are somewhat suspects. With the exclusion of public bodies, doesn't this make a, an investigation something of a secret one? Well, the, there is a frequently long delayed disclosure of the information that is gained. However, right now, it's been the practice and probably might be occurred again, there's the destruction of field notes by the people who are out there in the field that the public will never see. There are many aspects of this accident and every other aircraft accident that are never made public. The public file is a narrow one. The full scope of what has been discovered is much, much larger.
<laughs> well, I played real well today. Uh, I made a